Welcome to Lessons with John. Uh, today we're going to go, uh, we're going to try the No-No song by Ringo Starr. You're going to need a C chord, 1st string, 3rd fret. You're going to need an F chord, 4th string, 2nd fret, and 2nd string, 1st fret. That's your F chord. G7, you could uh, leave your finger on the 2nd string, 1st fret, 3rd string, 2nd fret, 1st string, 2nd fret. That's your G7. Three chords, that's it. So, uh, uh, what I did, I basically just did the verse and chorus. Those are the main sections of the song. Um, the, the intro is just, he's just hanging on a C chord, kind of introducing the song. Um, I didn't really bother with that. It's just, he's just hanging on a C. Uh, somebody is anyway. <laughs> Sounds like the little dog got a hold of the chicken out there. All right, so my verse is a C, two patterns, and then F, for, and then a C. Stay on C, go back to F, and then a G7, and then to a C. Then the chorus is no, 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 it's a C. Da, da. He's tired of waking up on the G7. No, thank you, please, it only makes him sneeze, and then it makes it hard to find the C chord. And that's the whole song. So, uh, our strum pattern's down, down, up, up, down, up, okay? So during the verse, uh, you know, uh, <laughs> now that's tidy. Um, it's a C chord for two patterns, and then an F for one, and then back to C. You got to stay on C, and then F. She said G7 was the finest in the land as a C. So that's your verse, okay? So every time that comes up, that's all they're doing. C for two. F for one, C for two, F for one, G7 for one, C for one, okay? And that's your verse. The form of the song is verse, chorus, verse, chorus, verse, chorus, chorus. There is an interlude in the middle of the song somewhere. Um, they got like a whole brass band playing or something like that, I think. Um, I didn't bother to, to figure that out. I, I figured this would be more of like uh, sitting around the campfire with your friends and stuff and just playing. Uh, the parts we know and stuff. I, the chances you have in a brass band with you, you know, probably Nilda. You know. You're not going to have it, so I didn't bother with it. And it didn't sound too complicated anyway. Alright, then the chorus is uh, the no, no, no part is a C for three measures. He's tied awake and up on the, and then a G7. Stay on the G7. And then it makes it hard to find, and then you go back to C. And then that's it. So the chorus is three measures or three patterns of C, G7 for four patterns, and then C for one at the end. And then that's it. So that's all you got. Verse, chorus, verse, chorus, verse, chorus, chorus. So you, you repeat the no, no, no part at the end. All right? Really simple. One of the simplest songs you're ever going to come across. And uh, thanks for watching. Please subscribe and play more Ook.